Okay, what we're shooting is AR-500 quarter inch thick steel. This is a level three rifle rated plate. And what we've done is we had rhino liners coat the plate with a quarter inch of uh, coating on the front to address the uh, shrapnel issue. Obviously when these bullets hit the steel plate, the bullet literally explodes and then you're, dealt, you're having to deal with shrapnel. And what we're trying to do is eliminate that shrap. We know the plate's gonna stop the bullet. We've already tested that. Again, this video is just to demonstrate uh, the shrapnel uh, stopping capabilities. The first two rounds I'm gonna shoot are gonna be from 15 yards. The first round is gonna be 223 hollow point, And the second round is gonna be 5.56 SS109 green tips, also from 15 yards. Here we go. Okay, I just shot the 223 hollow point from 15 yards and it's very hard to see and I'm sorry for a shaky camera. It hit right here. I see absolutely zero shrapnel. And later on in the video, I'll do an up close view of how small the actual bullet entrance is. I mean, it looks like a pen hole is it. But again, absolutely no shrapnel from 15 yards. Very happy, nothing at all in the box. Okay, this is gonna be 5.56 SS109 green tip from 15 yards. Okay, I know it's hard to see and I'll do a close up view later. We shot it twice now from 15 yards. The first round was 223 hollow point right here. About the size of a pen hole. No shrapnel whatsoever. And then our second round was right here, 5.56 SS109 green tip. Also, absolutely no shrapnel anywhere in this box whatsoever. Nice and clean, really pleased with these results. Next, what we're going to shoot is the same two rounds from 50 yards. Okay, guys, here's the plate that I just shot with 223. And right here is the bullet hole. Very hard to see. You can maybe see a little bit of it. Literally, it looks just like a pen hole. Absolutely zero shrapnel came out. And uh, very happy. Okay, the next one we're gonna shoot is 5.56 SS109 green tip from 50 yards. Here we go. Okay, everyone. That was the second round I shot right there. 5.56 and up here is 223. You can see the two holes. That's it. No shrapnel. Two just micro holes. Unbelievable results. Really, really happy for shrapnel protection. Again, these are AR500 steel plates with a quarter inch of rhino lining on the front. Very happy. Okay, these are the two plates that we shot. Each plate has one round of 223 hollow point and one round of 5.56 SS109 green tip. This was the first plate, plate that we shot from 15 yards. And this was our first round right here, the 223. And this was our second round, the 5.56. And I just wanted to zoom in a little bit just to show you guys how small of a hole we have. I mean, it's about the size of a pen. No shrapnel came out. Very, very pleased with the results. You can just barely feel that they're raised. You can feel the bullet fragments underneath it. So the, the rhino lining caught the shrapnel. And then this is our second plate we shot from 50 yards. This was our first round, the 223, and this was our second round, the 5.56. And I just want to show you guys up close again. Same thing, but the size of a pen hole. Now with the 5.56, you can see right here where it entered. We had one piece of shrapnel sneak out. I found that piece in the box, didn't penetrate the cardboard, so I strongly believe that it wouldn't even penetrate your nylon vest or your plate carrier that you were carrying. We're very pleased with the results, how these held up. These are AR500 steel plates, quarter inch thick with 
a quarter inch of rhino lining to stop the shrapnel.